Hello and welcome to season two of our Practically Speaking podcast. My name is Rachel Graham. I'm a transactional partner based in Harney's London office. And as before, I'll be joined by Amy Roos, one of our fiduciary directors, to discuss and chat about BVI companies. So really the message for clients now is evaluate carefully what you want to do if if you have decided that the entity is no longer required. As I've said, liquidation is always the message, but we have a key difference now in this strike-off cycle. Another consideration is uh, at the beginning of the process, certainly going into the BVI, is economic substance, which is a new hot topic as as we in the BVI all, all know. This season, we will be covering the life cycle of a BVI company. The purpose of this is to try and provide insight and information for directors, shareholders and security holders. We'll be looking at setup, director's duties, taking security, reorganisations, and also the status of a company during strike-off. And so what people are looking for, I'm sure, is to get an understanding, to get a feel for this law, to frankly know whether their vehicle is is within the regime or or is outside the regime very quickly. That'll be the one, but um, I think you've agreed to join me for another one of these chats at some point in the future, so I'm I'm sure we'll come back to you. (laughs) We hope you'll find time to join us for what we hope will be an interesting and informative new series of our Practically Speaking podcast.